Here we are once again after a good win against Brentford uh, against the odds really um, Brentford had a lot playing that game but still and Jaeger off give us the three points we're taking on Cardiff who are arguably the strongest side in this division they always seem to win, win this division every time I play through it and um, they've had a couple of purple arrows this edge and uh, I think it's Mr. Unpronounceable the right back to begin with there that uh, have suffered the purple arrow fate tired squad as well because this game's just a couple of days after another got some good news in the transfer front for January can we just get the ball through here oh good challenge um, and yeah four players deals done um, I'm down to 300,000 on me overall balance but there's time now playing games to bring that level of point, uh, coin up as Cardiff attack and end up having a shot deflected wide Giacomo's really up for this game um, Gomez is not playing so Giacomo's captain a few changes here and there Busto's playing at left back Castellis playing left wing, Maklashov playing right wing. There's my little squad. Start to feel the effects of close games together. This could be a long day at the office, this one against Cardiff. Okay. I'll give it a, a best shot, that's for sure. It won't be for the one to try it. Good save, very good save. Barbera in goal today, not Luna. Luna's just slightly tired, so I just figure, you know, play the one with the full energy. Let everybody else rest. We're going to need as many people with complete energy as possible for the games to come. Another corner pressure, more, more pressure for Cardiff. Can you get this one out? Maklashov has been shut down by two players, good challenge. Well, I don't know what you're looking at, Mr. Referee. Why is that a yellow card? It's a yellow card because their player fell over like a sack of spuds. Yeah, yellow cards were pathetic things on this game, I've got to say. He chucks them out like confetti. I think that needs fixing, that's an issue that needs fixing. I said before, I've had yellow cards when my players haven't even touched them. Um, that's genuine fact. So, right, Giacomo's got the yellow card, that is an awful pass. I didn't even angle it there. It looks like we're really up against it on this one. Back to the wall. Come on, give me a player. Right. January can't come around fast enough, I tell you. But it's going to be fun in the interim period just to see what we can do. Castellas. Let's get diagonal ball looking for this guy. Not going to pronounce his name. Wasberg had gone forward but we couldn't feed him the ball, keyed in the pass, but his feet are either sick, lame, or lazy, or all three. Come on, good covering in the end. This is the defender that I brought in. I think he's called Bude Pugliani. Probably pronouncing it all wrong. But yeah, he's um, a pretty decent defender. I think his overall rating is 66, but uh, there are stats about him that I felt he'd uh, definitely be an improvement over what we had. He'll do alright this season. He will. He'll do a good job back there. But there are better defenders on the way. But he will be a good good acquisition. He's only 20. 
He's got plenty of time to develop and he's got a bit of height about him as well. He's not overly tall. Buster. Wasberg. Just knocks it on for Catalyst. This is good now. Chip it into the box. Can anybody get their head on it? No, they can't. He didn't seem to jump for that. He kind of seemed to duck under it. Oh. Oh, watching the Leeds runners at the side and not the foot of the Cardiff man closing down the angle. He's going to try his tricks now. You know what's coming. It's, it's so predictable. Any team does that. Going to look for the tap in. I don't know what's happened there. My player should have cleared that. You press the square button on the PlayStation pad and he doesn't clear it and you wonder why. It's because Cardiff are the AI team and it wants them to put it in the net so it it seems to cancel your input. Maybe that's just me. Maybe it is actually the game. Right. See if we can do something here. I wanted that for Wasberg, but he's got it now. Take it into the corner, knock it back. Can we get a ball in? We can. Not do anything with it. Cleared by Cardiff. Just shy of the halfway line. Could be a foul here. Yeah, I just caught Cardiff players, he knocked the ball forward there. So Cameron Jones. Yeah, he's going to be uh, a threat, isn't he? Well, a threat. I think he's here. I think he's in. And he's scored. To keep my mouth shut. And my soul. Well, it's not entirely shocking that Cardiff have scored still building this squad I think they will probably be uh, a promotion side but we'll, we'll have a go yeah. Lasberg just kind of being pushed out of the way but he gets side up and try and control this one Kalatska 1-1 yeah, I didn't want to hit that first time. I thought I might have a, a chance of controlling him to bend it round. Don't know how much curl we got on that, but certainly we managed to control him around the defender and find the angle. Get back into the game straight away is always important, isn't it? I think against Cardiff, there's a danger that you concede one, you might concede another, and then you might be on hiding. Uh, I'm happy that we've got back into the game. Wasberg can pressure. He's, he's a good ball winner as well up front. Is Wasberg? He will weigh in with his fair share of work one challenges throughout the season. That's one of the things that I really do like about him. He does work hard up front. He's always looking for opportunities and always working his ear again. Can we lay it off for Galatska now? Just round him. Tell the player getting there first, but we're having some of the ball now. See if we can use it. Not enough time. Not enough time to use it. Well, not disappointed. Not disappointed at all after the initial threat of Cardiff. Um, yeah, very pleased with that. Right, I'll see you shortly for the second half.